I think Stove is Grand Champ 1. I think we're just going to call it that. Let's see what's going on. Grand Champ 1. We got 3s. Let's go, baby. That's how we start a game. I like where pacing's at. Pace looks good. Good chat. Good. Smart. Good. Good, man. You look good out here. If this is your best replay, I haven't looked at your gameplay in a while, but I mean, we just look confident. Um, we don't have a ton of ball control, but we look confident. Yeah, there we go. Um, the only thing I, I think I would, I would add to this, um, and I'll try to show some examples, is kind of completing our rotations, completing our transition. And what I mean by that is being able to move the ball up the field as a first man. And let's say we lose possession and the opponents start transitioning. The question is, what do we do after the fact? Do we just rush back? Do we find ways to play the midfield for a cut, play the opposite side for boost control? What does our value look like on the back end? This isn't bad right here, but we move the ball up the field and it's like, you could continue your rotation across right here. We're low boost, track your pads. There's gonna be no boost on this sideline because the ball's moving back to defense the way we moved up on offense. There's gonna be no boost, but getting oppo instead of turning ball side, because if we get here, more pads, more opportunity to cut. And if we can get enough speed, we can demo. I'm just, I'm looking for more of a completion of rotations across the goal line. Because every time I've seen a move up the field, we're either holding pressure as a third man. So like playing linear or uh, we're moving up the field as a first man. And then we go back down the same side. So it's kind of completing that rotation. I guess we could kind of call that cuts. I guess like the biggest thing I'm looking for cuts. When I see really good replays based on previous context, I don't like to change too much. It's like, let's make this consistent. Let me try to find some examples of this offensive rotation because that can sometimes fix defensive stuff as well. So look how we're going back same side. Now you're going for a bump on sidewall. Like there is value and I cannot stress enough that every decision you make is a fine decision. I just want to kind of inspire that thought process where you start thinking about instead of rotating back down the ball side maybe you get this boost demo demo let's say there's no demos now you're in a position to cut the midfield as this player cycles this way and you could refill a third man you also added value on the ball side, which is totally fine. But it's more of the, uh, I think my biggest thing with gameplay, or at least in this grand champion range, is diversifying. When I see a player make the same decision over and over and over, or the same control type, or the same mechanics, I just know that SSL and higher, you know, you're looking into the bubble scene. That's what separates players, is their ability to kind of diversify. Um, and obviously we're playing for a lot of, a lot of redirects, which is nice. Probably why I want you to get a, get oppo, right? Get opposite side. We could just call it rotations across the goal line. That would be the rotational advice. Position opposite side of the ball. That would be like positioning advice. Challenges a little bit more midfield cuts because they look good to me. Like our redirects and cut rotation looks good. So let's do more in the future. It would be uh, more ball control, but I, I like how we're playing. I think the rotational advice and then like cuts boost controller demos after that rotation will be really good. Probably just leave it there. It's funny. Like sometimes like cutting more and rotating across the opposite side of the field will open up more opportunities to control. Um, I actually like went into detail with that with a player in a private setting yesterday. 
we, we were talking about cutting and booming to create space to get opportunity to control, which like those concepts are like yin yang. You know, you're talking about control, but you're telling me to boom, like a weird kind of conceptual understanding, but.